Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and in this video I'll be yes on my Xbox account because I did this on my Xbox at the time but yeah and I'll be going through maps basically and map colors is not all of them by the way and because I need a lot of um, map art basically yeah, so, yeah, I do a lot of map art, and I just want to do this to get the spectrum of all the colors available. And I'll show you what I do. So, basically, I go up to this, whatever, and I just type in the coordinates already. And let's do magma. Uh-oh, I think I, oh, no. I think it was three. Oh, shoot, I better type this. Um, there we go. Then we just tap the button. And pop goes the magic magma, and yeah, it it gets laggy the first couple seconds, but that's fine. And then what I do basically, I just um, nope, it's up here. I do empty map, create map, and behold, we have our color right. And that's basically what I do for almost every single block. I didn't do any. I didn't do some of them because I already figured um, about so. Let's just get right into it, I guess. <laughs> okay, so I just I'm gonna just start off with all the colors, because um, I I don't I really don't know how to do this. So yeah, I named them on what block I use them first on. So yeah, so this one's the redstone. That's nether wart. That's nether rack. That's pink concrete. That's crimson nylium. I don't know. I th thought that was more pinkish. So that's boron and anything. But these are not you know ex like um creative yeah they're, they're only in creative mode basically so and in here i have more options so tnt and redstone basically have the same color this one has bricks red concrete and every anything with concrete goes with every single terracotta every wool every concrete powder basically and what's this uh yeah another rack has nothing pink concrete as pink pink con uh pink you know concrete powder wool etc this one's Crimson Nihilium, Boron, and where's the lava? I did lava earlier, I just don't know. I think it was the redstone, but whatever. Okay, let's get on to the oranges. We have orange, concrete, and fluorine. We're not using fluorine, so technically there's only one orange. And all of these blocks can be used for orange, including regular terracotta as orange. I don't know why. But yeah, honey block, sand, concrete, and yeah. And fluorine is just fluorine. I can't open it. Okay, there we go. Hey, alt. Okay. These are the yellows. There's only two yellows. Oh, three yellows, because sand's a yellow. Okay. Sponge. Okay, Bell. Yellow stuffs. Then we have gold, as you can see. And we have sand and endstone. Yeah. So for these, greens and the blues are the most. So uh, Also, beware. Um, some of these look really similar, but they're I tested them. They're all different, actually. So, so here, lime, basically. This one is green, if you like that color. This one's grass. This one's emerald blocks only. This one's leaves. Any leaves works for this one. I tested that. What's this? This is hydrogen. You won't be able to use that color. This is slime. So yeah. And dry kelp block. Oh, I moved it, but whatever. Doesn't matter really. And yeah. Seems pretty light, honestly. Should be as dark as the leaves, but okay. Let's unmove them to blues. After this, I'm gonna do a quick save. And yeah. Okay, light blue concrete. Basically, anything light blue. This is the prismarine, warp stem, cyan. So, yeah. Blue. This is the diamond, ancient debris. I was surprised ancient debris actually makes blue. I, I, I have no idea why. And dark prismarine. Wow! Dark prismarine goes like light blue. I don't know. That was smart. Not smart. That was weird. Okay, here's lapis. This color, you need warped. Warp block? Yeah, warp, warp block. Um. Crimson Nihilium. Honestly, uh, not Crimson, a Warp Nihilium. See, like, they're so similar. I don't even know why, but yeah, they, they have two different. This is Ice, which is like one of my favorite blues. That, that That is like one of the best blues, honestly. That's Lithium. You won't be able to use that. That's Beryllium. You won't be able to use that. And that's, what the heck is this? Is this water? I'm pretty sure this is water. I left that one for water. Also, I'm going to do a quick test on lava while I'm saving the clip. 
So yes, this is how I can confirm that lava is actually part of the redstone block. So, and if you look really close, you basically can't see where it splits. Well, I mean, like you don't know where it splits, but yeah, that's basically yeah how I figured it out. Basically, and let's go on. Why is it getting really bad? But whatever. Okay, here's magenta concrete. Purple and magenta goes together, makes this nice purple. And there's a regular purple. Oh, but why? Why am I lagging so hard? Which is mycelium and purple concrete. Helium, which you're not able to use. I mean, it's a sort of childish color, maybe. Actinium, which is, yeah, nice. And then we have black and block of netherite. This is, this is probably one of my most astonishing things, and I'll show you later. Yeah, here's just any type of black, basically. And this is blackstone, the question mark element, and black of netherite. Yeah, so that's nice. And next we have the grays, which has a huge spectrum. So we have gray concrete, which is anything gray. We have light gray, which is anything like gray. Then we have these, which are any iron command structure. I just tested, I think magma was one of them. Nope, this is something else, but yeah, it's one of these. Could be this one, honestly. Could be the scandium. Hold up, let me test this right now, because I don't think I've tested this before. Um, dang, why is it so laggy? Okay, let's test this right now. This versus the closest color we have. So the closest color we have is, not Scandium, it's um, Bone Block. Let's test Bone Block. And as you can see, it's like Bone Block. So Magma and Bone Block. Yeah, in the Bone Block category, there's a lot. We have bedrock stone, we have smooth stone, piston, bone block, any ore, any nether ore too. Scandium is just scandium. Clay, I put on this category, even though it's more blue. Just look at how big the blue line is, just give me a break. So this one is just basalt. So I organized the uh, grays later on, I'll show you over there. And we have two whites, damn, I didn't, I forgot. So here we have target block, lodestone, snow. And here we have quartz oh and any white block i i think it goes in this one yeah because yeah and yeah okay 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 let's move on the last color i tested was brown or classified that there we go and pink technically is a red so yeah okay here's the browns um brown concrete for this one for this one you need chest and any type of wood basically any that's why i put birch in there oh freaking Dirt is just dirt, and coarse dirt. Coarse dirt works for that too. This is aluminum, which you ain't not able to use. So, now let me get onto that. I'll do a quick save, and I'll meet you there. So here is basically a collection of every single shade, and yeah, as you can see, this is the black. This second black is the one, or technically gray, but this is the second one that I used for Jasper's World, naming all the islands. I used black wool, which is basically equivalent to black concrete. But since I discovered this, the block of netherite and black stone, which is so easy to find nowadays, um, yeah, I'm going to be switching them in my next episode. So, yeah, gee, I'm just letting you guys know on that. And look at all these shades. They're, they're beautiful, right? Scandium. Yeah, so... I didn't, I didn't have time to organize all these colors, but I tried to as best I can lazily and yeah you might think the yeah compared to other colors the clay block is more grayish but if you put this next to the grayish it doesn't belong so the clay block just sticks out like it doesn't have anywhere to belong and um yeah this is basically for any map artists who needs anything also oh i forgot to mention shulker boxes shulker boxes are equivalent to any you know um concrete carpets well, you know, etc. So, yeah. Oh, and here's where I tested for liquids, such as la water and lava. And that's about it, I guess, in this video. I want to be. I want to make this a quick video. Just um, see if anyone needs some map art. You can download my Valspar. No, I'm not down. I'm not. I'm not making this map for download, but um, uh, hope you found this video useful for anyone and i'll see you in the next video i'm jsd